It's funny because I was just uh, reminiscing with Michael. It's been like I've been here for like almost over four years with Michael. And you've been in the workshop for what? Three, three, and, a, yeah. going three and a half years. Mm -hmm. I, I think uh, looking back and seeing where Michael has taken us. It's for me to listen to you so you can tear out my goddamn heart. Before I met you and your company, everybody else told me I was wasting my time and that I needed to do it. Oh, now what you want me to say? I killed that woman. I killed that woman. The leader in the infidelity market. That's it. I got it. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to go before I change my mind. There's not a lot of work out there for uh, midgets these days. Do it. Yeah. Seems that all you want to do is abuse me and insult me, and now are protected by a union that is out of control and corrupt. <laughs> Sorry, but I love him. I know where you hide those magnets now. Go get them for me now, or I am going to steal them when you're too busy to notice. Now go! I dare you. To prove it to me. Mm -hmm. Take care of you and let you take care of me. So beautiful. Mm -hmm. I love you. The world is going to end. You need to know. The people need to know. And we were gonna have a baby. I guess things just sometimes they don't work out the way that you plan them to. I love you so much, and you are letting your friends have passionate sex in the backseat of your car? What about me? I know. As a group of actors, and having uh, himself come from a really fine uh, acting company, the acting company with John Houseman, that uh, his roots are really about building a team, and he's, he's taken the technology uh, of today and combining it with the uh, theater groups of yesterday, I think it's amazing. What do you, I mean, what do you got to say? That, is, that <laughs> is amazing because what he learned in his classes through his schooling. And studying with some wonderful teachers that are no longer on the planet. Right, and he can pass that on to generations who don't have the opportunity to ever study with those people anymore. So the, uh, the, it, which is amazing in itself too, because Michael started archiving when he was a younger kid. He's got stuff. Uh, he came up with Tree Ford Productions, which is actually we got in the beginning of the, the little thing with him actually building a treehouse. Mm -hmm. I guess uh, Michael's vision has been going on for a long, long time, and it's it's a very exciting time, not only for us but for the actors that are involved with us, and then for the actors that are going to be able to see, uh, but through the DVDs that Michael has a system that uh, you'll be able to take his home study course anywhere in the world, which is I, I always tell Michael's McGenius. He likes that word, <laughs> but he is McGenius. He sets such high uh, work standards, it's like unbelievable. Mm -hmm. He never sleeps. And also because he's not going to be teaching forever, the people who buy his DVDs can study with him, even though he's not going to be teaching at that time. Well, I tell my, uh, the, some of the students that are with Michael right now that we're, they're very fortunate because we really are a part of uh, history because mm -hmm. Michael is definitely a filmmaker and uh, once his book and books I should say come out with the uh, system that he's to set up and has a copyright on with the DVDs it's going to be unbelievable because he's got thousands of scripts that he's written and thousands <laughs> we've done at least a thousand of them you and I right? yeah in the last few years, <laughs> which is the greatest thing. I, I've been acting for, gosh, going on 30 years now, and I got 
fortunate to have studied with Lee Strasberg before he died and Stella Adams, some really great teachers, Jeff Corey. But the thing that Michael has really uh, taught me through his work ethics and having come from his work background of uh, really wonderful teachers is just doing the work. You got If you want to be an actor, you got to do the work. And uh, you and I are here every Tuesday night for the past three or four years for from about six o'clock to sometimes one, two in the morning doing the work. Mm -hmm. And I think there's, there's no big mystery about acting. It's about getting up and learning your lines and doing the work. Right. And even tonight I had a conversation with an actor who was in another class and talking about how she got together with the other actors to rehearse and I was just like, you know, Michael doesn't work like that because that's not the way it is when you get a job and you go onto the set. You don't go to that person's house and rehearse for a week before you show up and then you show up on the set, you say hi, nice to meet you, and then you maybe run it a couple of times and then you're shooting. So a lot of times you don't get a chance to run the scene. You just yeah. you show up on the set and You're lucky if you get to run and, it. And the director will give you some blocking or you might have one read through if it looks with soap operas they usually have a read through and then they do the blocking. But a lot of the television is so fast and it's like sixty, eighty thousand dollars a minute, so they don't have time for actors that don't know their lines. Right. You fight, as Donald Trump says, you fight it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you don't know your lines, boom, out of there. And that's why a, you, a lot of the actors on television that you see them over and over again. It's, it's not that they may be the greatest actors, but they they have a work ethic where they uh, show up on time, no uh, no attitude, no problems, and do the work. Mm -hmm. And that's really what Michael teaches us to do. He does. He doesn't teach you how to be a professional acting student. He teaches you how to be a professional actor. Which, once again, I say, Nick genius. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun these last four years. Yeah. And uh, I'm very grateful that we had the opportunity to be with Michael during this history-making time because uh, I think what Michael is doing with the technology, I mean, we shot over 300 shorts last year. Now we have our first official uh, short that we did recently uh, in just a, maybe like 10 hours shooting that's out to, uh, to uh, film festivals all over the world and getting ready to do our first feature film. And then we got a great website set up, the Total Workshop for Acting com. That's right. We're actually d directors, producers, uh, can go and, and see our work and, and what Michael has done as far as trying to really build a group of actors and to showcase them. Because the old theater showcases are really, uh, they're history, they're yesterday. Mm -hmm. And that's what's wonderful about the technology that Michael is utilizing because now he's taken us out to the world through uh, shorts and films and the DVDs, which hopefully you'll be doing scenes with both Sarah and I. We, I will, I look forward to that. So you better make sure you learn your lines. Because I know Sarah will have her lines down. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Any other uh, things you want to say, Miss Pettigrew? Just that. It's all about the work. It's all about the work, as Michael says. Lucky is when preparation meets opportunity. So, go to work. Learn your lines.